Well, welcome to NCTV 45 and uh, the final score from the field house. The Canes come away with a 65-51 victory. And uh, let's talk a little bit about the flow of the game and actually uh, how things started and what was going on. Latrobe very fast. Uh, the Canes jumped out to a 10-4 lead in the first period, and timeout was quickly called by Latrobe. As uh, then all of a sudden, score shifts to 13-6, still a seven-point lead. Right then, I think Newcastle realized they weren't walking away from this team. Uh, Latrobe, very, very fast. And uh, able to cover ground faster than any team I'd ever seen the Canes play. Now, as we started to get to the end of the first, start of the second, 20 to 12, and still only an eight point lead for Newcastle. We get to the halftime score, 28 15. That was caused by Latrobe having a few turnovers, and the Canes converted those. Um, whether they were a layup, a three point shot, something from the foul line, that was, in my estimation, the key to the game. Because right there was the 13-point lead. And then we embarked into the second period. 32-23, as um, out of the gate, Latrobe came out very fast. They were able to cut the lead to nine, 40 to 31. And I thought at that point, it was going to be tight. Now, the question came, was it 41-31 or was it 42-31? They, Newcastle went up for the shot and made it. Consequently, they missed the foul shot, but that made it 42 to 31, and the crowd was going nuts at that point because the scoreboard wasn't correct. With that, we go to, and we are embarking on the fourth period, 53 36, and then all of a sudden, just like that, and I can tell you, Latrobe, a very, very good team. They gave, the score is an indicative here of what was going on, 60 to 46. That was a 14 point lead for the Canes, and then they were able to. Uh, Slice that lead very quickly to 65-51, and Newcastle comes away with the win. Now, uh, they will play up at the Fieldhouse this uh, coming Wednesday. And uh, will be, the segment I call this is Breezing with the Canes, and I know that I gave you a news watch midday update <laughs> and if you want the weather and sports I guess we'll give them to you too but uh, looking at the bracket Newcastle will will advance and Laurel Highlands advancing with well Penn Hills winning and they're playing Laurel Highlands now and we'll uh, take a look to see if any scores 
are available from that game. Totally impressive. Penn Hills falls to Laurel Highlands. So the Canes will play Laurel Highlands at the Fieldhouse. Now, elsewhere around, Gateway, they fall to Shar Valley by 6, 53-47. Of course, we told you the Newcastle game, 65-51. And there's other games taking place that the scores haven't been reported in 5A. Trinity and Mars not updated yet. So um, just giving you a look around, and if you're wondering about South Park and the Laurel Girls game, that not updated either. So um, we'll uh, keep you posted on that. But the Canes win 65-51, and they will be going on to take on Laurel Highlands on Wednesday. We're going to uh, get and have Mass on Catholic Mass from Holy Spirit Parish. And you know our programming deal, so uh, make sure you tune in to NCTV 45, your community television station. And uh, with the final score, Newcastle 65 and uh, Latrobe 51. Thanks for watching NCTV 45. Thanks for breezing with the Canes. And uh, we'll see you again. We're available anytime on your time. Train that runs on your schedule. That's NCTV 45. We'll see you again real soon.